when you actually say what you do, people will buy from you. They'll hire you. <laughs> it, it seems like it's really simple. But after, after the conversation with my little cousin, I came back to New York and I took a class. Um, I was bad. I was really bad because I did the same exact thing that I'd done with her, which was, um, uh, but uh, what, what, do you want, what do you want me to say? What, what should I talk about? Which are the things? And by the end of the class, I was much better. And one of the other students in the class hired me because she said, through hearing my pitch, she realized that she had the same needs that I was able to offer. Like she needed the services that I was offering. I went out on a limb. I'm like, it's just a class. If it's not good, it's not good. Um, but I went out on a limb and I just started talking about the work that I had, could do, had done, and was looking to do more of. And that's all, all it took for someone to say, yeah, we'd love to hire you. I mean, mm -hmm. it, not every opportunity is for you. So mm -hmm. when you're yourself and you're putting, bringing to this conversation your whole self, the right opportunities do find you. You find them. So that's why I feel like it's important. If you're someone who makes something by hand um, and you're not telling people, listen, I made this, it's 100% cotton, you can wash it, I use this to do the backing. If you're not doing that and explaining to people what you're doing, they don't always know. Mm -hmm. um, they're not always going to ask. You need to put yourself out there and tell people, be able to explain, this is my work, this is my contribution. And also engage with people and not be afraid to ask them this is what I'm looking for. So um, not only do I do this, have I done that, but I'm also looking to do something else in the future.